next one is floral characters under floral characters this is the flower if you see the flower these three are petals which are yellow in color and these three are sepals which are in green in color here the essential organs are present this is the pedicel okay so this is the pedicel and if you take the ls of the flower the thalamus which is in a conical shape and here these are the stamens which are uh, numerous in number and also these carpels are also numerous in number which are present over the thalamus and on the thalamus these stamens as well as the carpels are arranged spirally thus this spiral arrangement of the carpels as well as the stamens is the one of the characteristic feature of the ananasi family clear coming to the floral characters first one is the inflorescence so cymose inflorescence is present cymose inflorescence means it is a type of a flowering shoot and coming to the flower second one is the flower so you see the diagram of the flower here so this is the structure of the flower where this is a pedicel is present and bracts are also present and this petals are three in number which are in yellow in color and sepals are three these are the sepals which are three in number and also in a green color and this middle portion where the essential organs are present that is ganesium and andresium and first of all what is a bract okay so bract means the reduced leaves reduced leaves are present at the base of the base of the pedicel okay this is the bract so here the flower is bracted so coming to the description of the flower flower is bracted br okay so pedicellate ebrl ebrl means absence of the bracteolates okay bracteolates means means leaf like structure leaf like structure present between present between bract and bract and flower is called bracteolate so in the diagram bracteolates are absent these are the bracts and this is the flower so in between leaf like structures if the leaf like structures are present those are called as bracteolate flower but in the anulaceae family the bracteolates are absent so that condition is called as e bracteolate okay next one is the complete flower complete flower means calyx corolla andresium gynesium all the four holes are present within a flower and bisexual and the next one is the actinomorphic actinomorphic means uh, if a flower dissect in any plane if a flower can be dissect any plane the flower gives a symmetry or equal halves that is called actinomorphic flower so next one is the trimerous flowers so trimerous flowers means number of calyx and corolla are three in number such type of flowers are called trimerous and hypogynous means the thalamus is in the convex shape where the position of the ovary is superior okay so that flowers are called hypogynous flowers this is about the flower description coming to the floral diagram this is the floral diagram this dot is axis and next this one is the bract and these three are the sepals which are free and showing the valvate estivation and this second hole is uh, petals which are three in number and these are also showing the valvate estivation and the third hole is the stamens which are infinitive in number and the coming to the structure of the stamen 
and this is the structure of this diamond so this is the dithecus and this connective grows over a anther which will forms the hood and this hooded anthers are the one of the important characteristic feature of the ananaceae family and coming to the ls of the ovary so the o ovary having the single ovule which is having the parietal placentation and next and these are the carpels all the carpels are free this character is called apocarpus condition so apocarpillary carp apocarpillary condition or all the carpels are, are together form a aggregate fruit so each part of the fruit is called as fruitlet so in analysis family the fruit is formed uh, by the all the carpets are free these character is called apocarp all the carpels are free and uh, this character is called apocarpus condition next one is all the carpels are together form a fruit this fruit is called aggregate fruit and each part of the aggregate fruit is called fruitlet and next now the fruit contains seeds this is the structure of the seed which is having the seed coat and the surface of the scotilidens shows infoldings finger like infoldings these are the finger like infoldings and these finger like infoldings are uh, nothing but the uh, ruminate endosperm so the ruminate endosperm is one of the important characteristic feature of the anonaceae family this is about the seed structure floral formula of the anonaceae family bractate e bracteolate actinomorphic flower bisexual k3 means sepals are three c3 petals are three andrisium is infinitive and gynesium is infinitive with hypogynous flower.